This is FYI on your TV, brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham, and I have got Ian and Isaac Dennis with us. Thank you very much for joining us today. Thanks for having us. You, yeah, thank you for having us. You two participated in the My View Youth Film Festival, and and you won a category. That's amazing. You guys, you guys made a film, and it was called The Impact of Climate Change. That's going to be my first question. How did you guys choose climate change? That's a huge topic. Um, we chose it because, well, it's a big topic and I know some of the things about it. It's bigger than you may think. It's, it's the whole world. You took a topic on that affects the whole world, not, not just the Kempfel area. And I must say, you guys are from the Kempfel area, right? Yes. That's right. That's right. And this affects the whole world. It's a huge, huge topic. So you guys made a, a film and it was about four minutes long. Yeah, yeah, it's about like four minutes long. Okay. Maximum almost five minutes. Yeah, okay. And then you guys did an amazing job. I watched it last night. It's, it's amazing. And I, I, what I really got from it that you guys were saying, it's not too late to change. We can help our planet, right? Yeah. Yes. There's lots we can do. So can we talk a little bit about what we can do? What can we do to, to help our planet against climate change? Well, we can not buy as much plastic stuff yeah make sure to throw your uh stuff in the garbage that's right and like you, you, you just you're button. mindful of this when you go shopping is not to buy so much stuff in plastic right yes and yeah. if you have plastic repurpose it so that it won't just yeah. be thrown in a garbage dump that's right that's that right. will contribute to the climate change worse that's and right. uh, we can also do a couple things like planting more trees and stuff. Planting, and how, how does planting trees help? That will absorb carbon. And how trees, do, yeah. planting them will absorb carbon, which helps a lot. And also planting flowers helps because Absolutely. it has pollinators that will pollinate, making the plants better and stuff like yeah. that make them healthier and, and so one, that way they and like, once again you guys ian you're 10 years old and isaac you're 12 years old yeah this is a huge yes. topic and i mean you guys are talking chemistry in here you're talking about co2 you're talking about all sorts of different ways to, to help the planet that's that's huge this must be a favorite topic in school in your classes yeah a bit it is eh? that's a, sort of a lot of science there right <laughs> A lot of science there, a lot of science there. Now, yes. you, you had said too to support local farmers? Yes, because yeah. that will make the, because they don't often use plastic packaging and also it would help sort of because if they were getting the stuff, then it would encourage them to plant, I guess, That's which would idea. make the planet better that's right yeah that's right now can we talk about making the film how did you how did you make the film do you have some help we actually, we actually uh used a basic phone with some help from our mom excellent and we also used a website called da vinci da vinci resolve for the editing mm -hmm. Because I, I was looking at it, and I, we, I do a little bit of TV work here. You guys are amazing. The editing, you did a really good job on the editing, too. Yes. Yes. Okay. Now, let's talk about June 12th. June 12th, you went to Brockville. Did you know you won a category when you went there? We only entered one of the categories. Okay. Yeah. So when you went on June 12th, did you know you were the winner of that category? No. They just no. announced it that late? It's actually a surprise for everyone. It was a surprise, yeah. right? Including the people who are announcing it. They didn't even know. Yeah, Yeah. not really. Okay, okay. So only the judges knew? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now, is this the first time you guys have, have put a film in together for this uh, film festival? Yes. Yeah. Wow. It's the first time we actually made a film. Right? Really? Actually. That was your first film? Yes. yes. Well, how do people watch this? Because I, I think I saw it on YouTube. 
Yes, yeah. it's on YouTube. If you look up, you can fight climate change by Dennis family, then you'll find it. Okay, okay. Yeah. And, and once again, that was your first film. You guys did an amazing job, the editing and, and everything. I mean, the, the topic that you talked about was wonderful, but just even the way you put it together and you edited, you did an awesome job. Yeah, we're always looking for, really for volunteers here. <laughs> we're always looking for volunteers here on your TV. You guys should think about that. <laughs> All right, there was one other thing you had said at the, the end there, that, that helping uh, climate change, you could write letters to local authorities. Yeah. Yes. Uh, you can, like, if you have, like, in your town, you have, like, a mayor, like, you know that often, mm -hmm. then... You could write a letter to them about climate change and they might help with it in the town. Yeah, it might be tell people to like do stuff to benefit the earth. Yeah. Okay, okay. Now you gave a lot of people a lot of different ways to help out and, and if people want to start in small steps, what is the first thing do you think people should do? Well, use less electricity and less plastic yeah make sure to turn off the lights that's a very good idea very because the idea. electricity is actually a huge carbon footprint okay now when you say a carbon footprint what is that well basically or maybe i said it wrong i don't know because i mean you mentioned in the in your your film too about uh the the it, i think, think it was the air around the earth that's what's mm -hmm. being affected Yes. yes. Yeah, because it's gases that trap the sun's heat, That's like it. Isaac said, in yeah. the film. Yeah, so like the light, like the heat will come in here, uh, the stuff like around here, and it like uh, will have less, like it'll have more trouble leaving if there's more, but if there's less, it can leave a little more freely. Like it's not a bad thing to have that. Because then the world would be a popsicle. Yeah. But if there's too much of it, the world will overheat and uh, there won't be much life. Absolutely, absolutely. There's more fires and also, oh, there are glaciers are melting which are making animals lose their homes, yeah. which is a very bad thing. For a while, I thought that the thing about polar bears losing their homes was like kind of an exaggeration. I thought they were on land more, like solid ground. But it's actually true. A lot of polar animals, not just polar bears, are actually losing a uh, home. And, and, and that, that's where they rest. They can't just spend all the time in the water. Absolutely, absolutely, yes. And you talked about trees too. We're losing a lot of trees. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's right. Wow. And we'll start more fires, which makes lose us lose a bunch of trees. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So that's the importance of planting a tree and making a garden too. It's like a butterfly effect. You not know, turning on the lights will make more carbon dioxide. And making more uh, gases, which will heat up the planet more, which will make fires happen more, which will make these trees, which will make the carbon come out, and yeah, it'll work. Repeat the cycle. It, absolutely, and it's something as easy as turning the lights out when you leave the room. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. So, can you tell well, everybody once again where where people can watch your video? Well, go on to YouTube. Okay, and then go look up you can fight climate change dennis family and you will probably it will be like one of the first results of course there were some advertisements it's one of the first results we're then, not at the most popular so if you search that you yeah. might like just the title you might have to do a lot of scrolling so just type in dennis family which is what our account's called okay that would be you want to see it again with the name well, yeah. I encourage everybody to take a look at your, your video. You guys did an amazing job. And yeah, congratulations for winning the category. You won the category for the 10 to 13 year old. And uh, I think it's great that you two did this together as brothers too. I think that's wonderful family, uh, 
little thing to do together. So good for you for doing that. So I encourage everybody to take a look at it. Congratulations on winning the category for 10 to 13 year old for the My View Youth Film Festival. And it is sponsored by the Leeds, Granville and Lanark District Health Unit. How did you find out about the film festival? Well, we, I don't know, our mom's down to the youth center sometimes. Okay. And because I think they were one of the sponsors for one of the categories. I think it was my community right? that they sponsored. So that's how we found out about it. Excellent. Well, I'm glad you did. You guys did an awesome job. Congratulations. Thanks for coming today and uh, taking the time to talk to us. And once again, I encourage everybody to take a look at your video. Go on to YouTube, check out the impact of climate change and look, out, or look for the Dennis Family uh, YouTube account, right? Yes. Uh, Actually, it's called You Can Fight Climate Change. Yeah. You Can Fight Climate Change? Uh, yeah. Yes. Excellent. Excellent. You're going to do another project like this? I hope so. You guys did an amazing job. Probably next year we'll do another category. Perfect. Perfect. Well, we'll actually do like a regular one and then a my community one. Good for you. Good for you. Well, I hope I get to talk to you again next year. Thanks for having us. Thank, Thank you, you very much, us. gentlemen. I have got Ian and Isaac Dennis with me. Thank you very much, gentlemen, for doing what you're doing. You're making an impact. <laughs>